Hey, hello there, my name is Wookie Inara, and welcome back for another round of Seven Days to Die. Uh, so last time, the last Horde Night I did for a video was Night 49. Um, I did do a Horde Night, the most recent Horde Night, uh, in a stream. Um, and I had said during that stream that I wanted to, by then, or by the, this Horde Night, I wanted to, basically, I wanted to be at... Um, I wanted to be able to have the Horde Knight at my house, but that didn't happen. Um, I didn't have everything ready, which kind of sucks. Uh, so I just decided, um, why not? I will do this. I, uh, I was working on getting the SMGs, uh, the SMG turrets ready, and I... I have the house surrounded, it's just I have to get them, um, loaded. I have to get them, like, all filled up with ammo and stuff, and I don't know why this isn't doing anything. It should be doing something. There we go. Okay, it's just taking a minute. I don't know why this one isn't on a swivel. There we go. Yeah, the last one, I was like, the last one's on, uh, the, the SMGs are on a swivel. I don't like those guys. I hate these guys so much. I feel like I didn't grab everything that I wanted for tonight, but you know, we, we make do. I'm still working on, um, you know, getting enough levels that I can um, do the uh, Oh, hello, friend. I was like, I don't think it's anything about me being up here. I've got that. That thing is fully loaded, so that's, um, 450 rounds in there. I wanted to have, as you can see, I was setting it up, I wanted to have it so that basically every one of the, the corners had its own thing. <laughs> I just realized something now. Now I can't cross this bridge with my vehicle. At least I don't think I can. I know I... Oop. And of course the shotgun has less of a range than the the SMG, but I didn't have the, the back at my house the, the there's still more shotgun turrets being made um, there's three more of them being made so more than likely by the time this horde night's over all that stuff will be done you know, just in time for it to be done but, yeah, I decided that that's what I, I then decided when I was setting this stuff up, I just decided that this is probably, that was probably the best corner because that's generally where they came from is over there. So I figured that was probably my best bet. Oh, 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 oh. It's not, a, I don't think the shotgun turrets as powerful as the, the SMG turret. And I mean that and, you know, the, the SMG turret puts off more rounds per minute, so you know, that always helps. I mean, it's, it's not bad, at least it gives them a little bit more damage before they... So I honestly don't have to waste all that much ammo on them. Um, it would be nice, though, if it was a little bit more powerful. Right. 
pretty certain. They'll, they'll eventually start coming from over here, but they haven't yet. I had an issue last the, the last Horde night, um, where I had said normally they don't bother. They don't bother my vehicle. They just like they don't feel the need to. They basically just either they'll jump over it or they jump past it or go walk around it or whatever. But for some reason. The last Horde night, I had kept having so many different zombies, like, it, like, they would jump on it, but then they'd get stuck. But, um, I don't know, it was weird. But... I, yeah, I had said that I wanted to have the ability to fully have my Horde Knight at my house by the, the by this time, but as we can tell, that didn't happen. I'm also working on upgrading not just like the the defenses around the house. I'm also working on things like the um, the like actual structural integrity of my house, like. Uh, as you had seen before, I'll, I'll show you when I get, like, done with this Horde night, but, um, which is still gonna be quite a few hours. Ooh, hello. Um, but, yeah, I did, there, I made some different improvements to that, uh, to my house, um, from that time. Crap. I have to try and get down there so that I can turn the camera view of the turret. Yeah, the, and that's the, like the a uh, little bit another reason why the the SMG turret's a little bit better because for the camera view, it's better as well. There we go. There we go. Like, if I were to pull back out my wire tool, um, I could show you that, like, the, the range of this one. I've not really used one of these too much. I mean, I've used them in the past, but, like, not very often. Ooh, that's loud. You forget how loud the, the, like, the guns are when you don't, when all your guns are silenced. But I mean, whoa, what is that thing? What is that thing? Oh, that's like a... I've never seen that before. He's gonna blow. Holy crap. Oh, please don't tell me I've got to deal with any more of those tonight. That would suck. That would majorly suck. He should be set to target uh, enemies and zombies. Wish I could do an LMG uh, <laughs> turret. That would be so much cooler. Even if I could just make like a tripod, and then I could control it. Like instead of having like the junk turret, like a like a Browning. That'd be cool. I would be totally down for that. Oh, hello. Oh, I'm bleeding. Yeah, the 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 
one thing definitely helps. The turret definitely helps. And like my, my house is, it's surrounded enough that um, each turret's field of view should be enough to deal with the amount of zombies that I get. And I mean, like, the amount of zombies will change over time. And I have had a couple of other, like, random parades of zombies that'll come through. Um, it's gonna be a lot harder for them now, though, because Ellie, uh, I did change the, the doors. Um, I still have the the double door set up, so normally if they head towards the doors and they start beating on the doors, they have to go through two doors instead of just the one. Um, but the doors are not just, uh, it's not like the iron doors that I had before or the iron, uh, like upgraded iron doors because the ones I had before were like the highest level upgrade you could do for those. Um, but they are now vault doors, which are more powerful, of course, they're, they're stronger. Um, they're the like second level upgrade of them, I wanna say. Or second or third level upgrade for them. Because I did upgrade the vault doors as well. Because you can just keep upgrading doors until you finally reach their, like, max potential. I want to say that I have never had a horde knight where I have just been able to basically, like, sit back and relax. So it'd be nice to have a horde knight where I can do that finally. Just like sit back and let the let all the turrets and stuff do all the work. Kind of sucks. I it, I don't know how bad the other ones are. I'm curious about the. I'm gonna check on the generator. See and the. It's been several hours that that's been on, and it's still doing pretty good for gas. I'm, of course, I'm gonna turn it off when I leave. Um, I might have to soon go back out to the desert like I had done the... Like, I did that off-camera one day where I just went out, um, and I drilled... For oil for a couple of, or for oil shale for a couple for like an hour at least and I got a good amount of it so I was able to make refine it down into gas. I don't like those guys. I think the these ones are like they're just like a little bit more powerful than these ones than or not those ones the. Maybe they're about the same power level as the, um, the military zombies. Maybe? I don't know. I just don't like them because it's like, they have a more threatening look to them, you know? I haven't used the... I've only used this a little bit. See, just like look at him. He's got, and I mean, yeah, the like the glowing ones. They're kind of threatening, but like, what's really more threatening? Because like he looks like some mutated, like thing. Like he's not even human or undead human, whatever. Oh, please don't send me whatever that thing was. I, I'm gonna have to look that guy like look that up because like, um, they technically all have names, not like actual like names names, not like a normal 
like person's name, but there's like the festering cadaver and then the like just roaming one or whatever and stuff like that. They all have names, but because I have never seen that guy before. Oh, there's 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 a couple of them that I have seen personally, but haven't seen yet on this playthrough. And it may or may not be, I don't know if they had gotten rid of them or not. Like, there's this, um, kind of looks like the little girl from the ring. Um, but she, like, I can't remember what they call her. But basically, she sees you, and then she starts screaming. Um, and when she starts screaming, she, like, she spawns in zombies, so it's not just like she draws in zombies, but she spawn like zombies spawn near her, and like I've run into like a parade that's got like two of two or three of them, and are also the zombies that are with it. So you can imagine how fun that is. This thing's not as on as much of a swivel as I would like it to be. I guess it's because the sensor doesn't necessarily, like, I can't, ne I can't really see the, whatever action the sensor is doing. But, I, I, I'm guessing if I were to see what action the sensor would be doing, it would basically just be looking in this area. Night's almost over. I definitely have to look that guy up, though. Because that was freaky. And look at that. He did a giant hole. Fortnite's over. I don't know. Okay, I don't know if I'd technically consider Horde Night over until I get rid of all the zombies. At least all the zombies that were spawned in for Horde Night. But yeah, the, the process of getting to um, where I am currently is, is taking a, an incredibly long time. Um, I'm going to take the engines from this. Because I literally, I, I stole the engines out of some of my other generators back home to throw in that for the night. Um, because I thought I could make the engines, I cannot make engines. I either have to find them via tearing apart cars, or I have to buy them. So, I, I've i found some via tearing apart cars. I've bought some. I've actually bought a lot of different, like, materials and stuff just to make more ammo or make uh, the things that I need to make. I mean, in that and I've, I'll show you some other things that I've done. Like, I have taken um, how I had that full that, like, box that was absolutely full of melee weapons. I took and I broke down most of those. Um, and some of them break down into their parts. So it'll be like spear parts or whatever. Um, but then some of them break down into other parts. Just throw them all in there for right now. Um, but yeah, see? The house is completely surrounded in turrets. Um, I'm gonna try and make more iron spikes to go around the rest of the house, but that's after I finish upgrading, um, the... Other stuff, yeah, and some of this. I misclicked this one, but there's no way to pick up turrets that I know of. Which kind of sucks. Because if I could. And like if I were to here. And as you can see, the, the yellow. The entirety of the yellow is their, their, basically their cones of 
murder. <laughs> it's how far they cover. So they, they cover a good majority of the outside of my house. Um, uh, that's a battery bank. I'm not using it necessarily. This is um, level two upgraded concrete, whereas this one's just like level one. Um, then I said I changed the doors to the vault doors. These are the vault doors. Um, but they're... This one's an upgraded one. Um, this one is not. That one's just a normal vault door. Because uh, I ran out of... I want to say forged steel. Because that's what I needed was forged steel. Um, and I ran out of that. Oh yeah, and I was making the other one, but I ran out of... Yeah, so I only have the, the two other chat the two other... I see I had enough stuff to make those things, but like here, I tore down a whole bunch of these things, made them into supplies. Um, I actually, because it's just the rate in which I find all the different, the melee weapons and guns and stuff like that, the rate I find them, um, I can't sell them fast enough. Uh, because then I'm just sitting there with all these, like, things, and I'll either get better leveled ones or whatever. And I just decided finally, screw it, and got rid of a whole bunch of them. Um, basically through... Sat there for a while. <laughs> it was mostly last night sitting there for a while, and just, like, because of course I have that queue and it takes a certain amount of time for stuff to be broken down, I sat there and would just click through and wait and click through and wait. And, like, that's that's just stuff I don't want you guys to have to sit through because that's just boring, and I wouldn't want to have to sit through that, so why would you guys have to sit through that? I'm gonna, I think these... Oh, I was already <laughs> wearing... Okay. Um... Put, throw this stuff in there. I have to go through and um, I'm gonna try and make myself better, better armor and stuff like that because I can. Um, so I'm gonna do that. Uh, there's probably some other stuff that I'll try and do. I'll definitely work on the whole. Um, some other random stuff, but like I said, I, I started and I took a break down, broke down a whole bunch of that and so a whole bunch of that gave me like a lot of iron, so I've just gotta smelt down a whole bunch of that iron now. Um, but did that, I've gotta make more cement mix to work with the rest of my house, and like I said both sides of these both of these are um there's still a few of the uh, the turrets that aren't hooked up to generators yet, because I was doing it like um, three generator or three turrets per generator, um, and then I've got to get engines for each generator because uh, it, it takes six generators to fill it, um, and then uh, fuel for them. It's just a long process. It's, it literally is just a long haul process. And it's it's just something, because it's never something that I've like truly sat down and paid enough attention to to do. Um, I at some point would like to probably work on the inside of my house too, make it look a little bit nicer. Um, but that's just something that's going to have to wait for a little while. Um... But it'll happen eventually. If there's anything else that you guys want me to do um, inside here, maybe there's different game modes or stuff. Because I know there's there are different modifications for this game. I like I think that there is enough in this game by itself that you don't need to play with any of the mods. But that's that's just my personal opinion. Um, but I can do other things if you'd like me to. Um, there's some things that I haven't really tested out, like some of these, like the higher explosives and stuff that I haven't really tested out yet, like, 
I found these that, like, I didn't even know were a thing, um, and whatnot, but I'm, I'm gonna keep going, uh, I'll probably stream this again at some point because I find this a more fun game to stream um, rather than, than to just, you know, do Let's Play Zelda. I don't know why. It's just something that I do. Um, but I'll do that. So keep keep your eyes out for this on Twitch. Um, stream at Twitch, uh, twitch.tv slash uh, Wookie and our ga gaming. Uh, I always put a link to it in my the bios. Um, oh, I think I mentioned this. Um, or I might have mentioned this in the stream. But if you look around and you see the different... Um, there's some of these things that it, it says safe. And that's because there's a gun safe there. Uh, so i just marking down on the map where exactly there's gun safes so that when those take however long they take to respawn the stuff inside of them. Um. Then I know that I can go back and go back to them and get the stuff out of them and keep going with those. Um. But I'm gonna say that I'm all out of time for this one. Um, I'll probably make... I'll, I might do what I did this past time and basically do, um, cause the, like, the, there's a lot of days to this game. I don't know if it ever technically ends, but, um, I'll keep going. Um, might do, like, wait, like, two weeks and do another, like, two weeks in game time and do the, the Horde Night, uh, the next, after the next two weeks, I might stream the Horde Night of, um, the in-between then and you know just whatever um but this isn't like i was doing i'm not gonna do that like every single day thing because it just gets really boring um and some days sometimes things don't happen during the days um but i am all out of time for this one uh, if you like this video please like share and subscribe and i'll see you in the next one